We're going to attempt a leg transplant. Not attempt, just do. We're fine. We've done like 10 before. We're good. A duck, obviously. That's very important. Right. That gadget with Where's the screen is a diagnostic scanner. It'll tell you what's wrong with your patient. Lesson he one. has become a duck. Keep That's a close eye on Bob's blood level. If he bleeds out, it's game over. Oh, well, okay. Or, or saving his family medical bills. You ever think of that? No, you didn't. Bob, you have a good old moustache. Check it out, man. Just make sure we get rid of this evidence just in case. Uh, just hide that over there. Just in case, you know, insurance for myself. Scam myself and pretend I'm Bob. Look, everything's good. But Bob's not even here. Is it just because I put this duck on it? What's the button? Oh, I was. Sorry, Bob. <laughs> According to the scanner, Bob's got a dodgy right leg. Rip it off. Oh, yeah. Usual style then. Let's rip his leg off. Now, oh, I did. The leg oh, in Jesus. The uh, I mean, this is it's meant to happen. Now what? Uh, that can live on the side because that's what we do. What have we got to do now? We need something to like, you know, uh, he's dying very quickly. Jesus, Bob. What about this? Let's get this out. No, just, just, just get that in there a bit. Oh uh, yeah. You know, all right, mate. Surely we've got like, you know, what do you call them? Bandages. Bandages. You bandage. What about alcohol? He won't feel any pain if we get hold of. I can't grab anything. I only had about ten drinks this morning, whiskey wise. It's not that many. Better luck next time. Oh, Bob. Rip nah, his white right leg off and put it in the chute. That's right, he's back again. Look. Fuck me. Put it in the chute. That's where I'm going wrong. Right, leg off. I'm guessing we're putting it in here. Ah, dispose of them in the right place. We need to put his right leg in the chute. It was his right leg, wasn't it? I. <laughs> I wasn't. That's fine. I'm only a bit blurry eyesight. Okay, sorry, Bob. Got this bit wrong. Rip his right leg off and put it in the chute. Oh, it's not that easy when I've just left out, did it? There we go. Oh, Jesus. There it goes. Okay. There Great. Yeah. Now I use a yellow syringe to stop Bob's bleeding. Yellow syringe. Ah, now you've given me the tool I requested. Like this. Oh, no, nearly got you. Oh, I'm getting you in the wrong place. Sorry. Sorry, Bob. You Stop Bob's position. bleeding with a yellow surface. Now, yeah. grab the fresh leg and just pop it on. There you are. And I can go in there as well. We don't need that tool ever again. Probably. Uh, this leg? Nope. Oh, you know, 10 second rule. It's fine. And. Yep. I mean, how much do I have to do this when I'm only left-handed? This is difficult. Grab the leg in the leg. Why can't I just have a second? I just must be filming the whole thing with my one hand, right? Oh, 10 second roll. Quicker. It's fine. Whoa. Okay. Whoa. That's fine. Lovely one. Yeah. Remember, when you rip off an appendage, Bob will bleed out very quickly. You're welcome, Bob. Let's continue. All right, next patient, please. We're in the next room. Looks like Bob's low on blood. Give him a top up with a red syringe first. Don't worry, Bob, I got you. This is not a problem. Uh, right in the, somewhere. Okay. All right, we need to move, yeah, uh, stab. Oh, I mean, inject nicely. He's looking better already. See? Rather than just ripping off a limb, use a little more finesse this time. Oops. Why don't you grab a saw? Yeah, For good can... sawing technique, grab the saw straight on. If you need to realign your grip, drop it and try again. All right, Align the saw with the tool. cutting line, place it down gently and Can't saw back tell and forth until the limb drops. Can't tell job. Just giving a saw. Where's my saw? In here. There he is. We're good. Let's just grip hold of... Saw his right arm off and pop a fresh one on. And just got it. We're gonna turn it, and we're gonna. Oh, oh sorry, that's just wrist. That's just something. Oh, it's got a bit stuck. I mean, that happens sometimes. It's fine. Just get your hand in there. Saw his right arm. Oh, sorry, oh. Fresh one on. Then I can roll again. Cricket. 
you're not doing well with this. I saw my own fingers off here, Bob. I hope you didn't realize the danger I'm putting myself in. Oh, your face is fine. Don't you worry. Saw his right arm off and pop a fresh one on. I'm trying. Jeez, she's so bossy. It's fine. There we go. There we go. Turn. Turn. Down. Just need to get hold of a saw properly, that's all. Just... Crap. Oh, I just pulled something out I shouldn't have. Uh, um, um, needle, right? Let's just jam this thing. It's empty. Sorry, Bob. Going around a little bit. It's fine. Okay. I haven't performed this in years. Saw his right arm off and pop a fresh one on. Oh, I've got to do my other duties first. Yes. Oh, oh, it's got, yeah. Oh, yeah, this might be, uh, we'll blur that bit out. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, it's feeling better already. Feeling better already. Okay, let's do the needles. Why is it so low down? Why are you so low down, Bob? I'm not supposed to get to anything in here. That's not helpful, is it? We're gonna have to just, like, have a guess, right? Drop. Oh, that didn't work. Yeah, I might just have to kill this Bob because he's stuck in the floor. That's not helpful. Saw his right arm off and pop a fresh one on. Oh, we're stuck. We're stuck in something. Let's just wiggle it around a bit. Oh, my saw! My saw! No! <laughs> Do the sawing. Saw his right arm off and pop a fresh one on. Jesus! Hey, the table's come up, finally. He's fucking gonna bleed to death now, isn't he? That's not fair. It's making noises like soaring noises, isn't it? His arm's it's stuck on. That's your problem, but your arm's stuck on. Nasty. Give it another shot. There is his arm, look, I did it. So you can't say I didn't. Ah, oh, Jesus. Doyle. Saw his oh, right arm off and pop a fresh one on. Nothing wrong with ripping it off in the first place. Yes. Right, let's get this arm on. Come on, grab the arm. Grab the arm, this one will do. Might be an old one, but whatever. You really are something. Yes. Now remember, oh, yeah. for a successful appendage transplant, Bob must have all of his limbs and head attached. Let's proceed. Okay, so if you enjoyed it and you think Dr. Dan's skills are amazing, because they just are, uh, give us a comment in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe also. We really need some more uh, you know, reason to keep doing this. So drop us a subscribe. Uh, if you want me to do some more surgery, um, we might even be able to get Bake to do some surgery. He might be really good at it or really bad. Again, drop us a comment and we will get cracking with that for you. So if not otherwise, go check out some of our other stuff. We've got some uh, interesting Dueling Dome stuff and various content from over the years. So yeah. And we'll see you next time. Bye.